just miss them heights and steeps. I actually, do, I like jazz music. I do not like jazz guitar. I think jazz yeah. guitar is soulless. I like, I like more like a <laughs> jazz piano. I love jazz piano. Or I got this. Do you, have you ever heard of Les Baxter? That sounds familiar. I got it. I, I so I got it. Um, you, you ever watch that? Um, what's in the my bag thing? No. It's it's this. It's fucking awesome. It shows a, uh, and that's speaking of like influences. Uh, it. So Amoeba Records in San Francisco is this fucking very renowned record store. The tambourine player from Brian Jonestown works there because I stalked him down. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I'm serious. Like, like, <laughs> like when I, dude, I'm not even joking. I'll fucking admit it. I got nuts about Brian Jonestown massacre out of nowhere because for the longest, you know, I'll just tell this story and I'll, I'll fucking confess. For the longest time, I was the angriest fucking person. Like nothing but metal, metal, metal. Want to kill everybody. Like all that shit. And then I started listening to Brian Jonestown massacre. I'm like, wow. This is so much of a better life <laughs> with this <laughs> than all this other fucking noise and Varg, that cocksucker. You know? <laughs> Any, anyways, I started listening and, and I'm like, I, I really, I got to see what San Francisco is like. Because all this, sh- even even if I didn't like Grateful Dead, I'm like all this positive shit and vibes is coming from San Francisco. And I had to visit and I heard that Tamarine Player works at the record store. So me and Adela went, I had like my phone in my front pocket turn on like hi we really like your band <laughs> we just have <laughs> it on for like 20 minutes and the whole and like i was high as fuck because we bought edibles at, at a dispensary there so i'm just kind of just i i also bought it to to kind of chill me out and not seem like a fucking stalker <laughs> so, so and, and and so the whole time i'm talking to him i'm like oh that was so cool i bet he didn't even notice and then I come home and I'm sober and I watch the video and the whole time he's like eyeing the fucking camera. What the fuck is this psycho? T- <laughs> 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 and, the, and you know, th- he recognizes me every fucking time he comes to Chicago. Cause did you, like, did you see I'm him not at the last fucking, show? I, I didn't, I didn't, well, I didn't, um, does he like, does he like see you eyes go wide with terror and he like rushes no, off the no, stage? Well, well, people tell me <laughs> that I have, like really vibrant eyes because they they go from like green and brown back and forth so i could tell him he's looking at me on say i'm not telling i'm not joking around <laughs> and, and and even and this sounds like some stalker shit right no, no. he's looking at me <laughs> <laughs> my beautiful eyes More like <laughs> my, yeah my beautiful eyes my beautiful gems in this fucking dome you know no, but I mean, no, I, I, I don't even no, I don't want to meet them anymore. Like before or after because of that shit, because I feel embarrassed. I'm like, like I, I'm cool. I, 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 I've gotten on a cooler level with the band because like the one guitarist put this show together for me. But I'm just saying the back to Amoeba Records and not my stock story. Um, they have this thing on YouTube where they have random art, like all these fucking awesome artists come in and they let them pick out like 10 records for free. And then they talk about them like, why did you pick this? Why did you, like, what is this part of your music musical style? And they had King Gizzard and Lizard Wizard come in. Oh, that's nice. And they had, uh, he's like, oh, I like this Les Baxter. And he's like an African jazz. Uh, it, Dude, you know what it reminds me of? Like, really improvised African piano jazz. Ki- and it kind of reminds me of, do you know the, the background music in like the 1960s Batman? <laughs> Yeah, I do. Like that Actually, kind of Adam like, West. Yeah, yeah. Like that kind, of, like that chill, uh, jazz bar sh- shit. Like huh. that's what it reminds me. I don't know. It's really fucking. That's all I listen to at work. It's like relaxing as hell. But Afro it, but, jazz, I can imagine. Yeah, but 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 it's really it's a really cool thing to sh- to watch in general because because like they have they have really like they had the guy from Pentagram on there, the singer. Yeah, I saw that. Th- they had a power trip on there, and it's really funny because like the one guitarist actually likes a lot of shit that I like failure and Ken Andrews and like space rock. And then the other guitarist, because they're from Texas, he like likes nothing but Pantera. old ass. Con- no, no. ZZ top. He loves ZZ top. Yeah. They fucking love ZZ. <laughs> and then, and then the rest is just all old school. Like you haven't ever heard of them. Hank just Williams. Country. Well, I yeah. guess I would, you probably heard of Hank Williams, but <laughs> Is this the Mighty Stephen?